I was just like floating in my ship. I was like, huh? That's what happens when you join on me. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another episode of the Beard Brother Play No Man's Sky. Everybody, run! Get out! No, I'm kidding. Y'all should watch us. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Y'all, y'all should stick around. Uh, last episode, I was looking for some solanium. How much do you need? My inventory is full. Um, I'm I found some. I'm standing right here at it. I just okay. my inventory is full. Um, we need selenium, selenium for reasons. You you know reasons. This is the living glass that Bryce gave me. It's very expensive. Pugnium. I don't need all this pugnium. What the heck I need all this pugnium for? Or this big I wouldn't old bend over to pick up a single piece of living, living glass at this point. <laughs> we, oh, did you farm? Yes, I did. Good lord, Bryce. How rich are you? Uh, 244 million and counting. Bryce, good god. <laughs> well, guess Bryce did some stuff off camera, folks. Bryce did some, uh, some... Some getting rich <laughs> without us. <laughs> some, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm not as wealthy as Bryce. I, I feel you could like easily have as much money as I have within a 20 minute video. Good gravy. How did you do all that? Uh, there's a duplication glitch apparently. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. You told me about that. So I made a stack of living glass put it in the thing and duplicated it until my inventory was full and then sold it all. We well, might need to teach people how to do this duplication get glitch. Uh, it is not my duplication glitch. I do not know who found it originally, mm. but I was told about it by my friend Conrad. Uh, I'm, I assume then that you may have, there's probably already videos out there. Most probably. Bryce, here's a question for you. Have you ever gathered selenium before? Indeed. Uh, were they around these, the, like, pointy, obelisk-looking rock things? Pointy, obelisk I'm just gonna come down. I'm right above you. I'm just trying to point out how, uh, kind of jarring and weird the animation of gathering selenium is. Oh, yes, the, uh, <laughs> slight jiggle. Yeah. The yeah. J the jiggle is what I'm referring to. Very interesting jiggle. I'm gonna name this planet, by the way. Alright. I'm gonna name it. Oh, have you. Nope, you've already submitted it. Oh, discovered by Conrad812. Okay. Oh, Conrad found this planet. He already uploaded it. Very well. Very well indeed. Alright, I've got lots of selenium. I also got a new frigid. A new frigid? Mm hmm. Now, how'd you, do, how'd you do that? Uh, I went to one of those encounter things. Mm hmm. <coughs> and I rescued him, and I bought it. Nice. Because you have so much money. Indeed. Do you find that the the game is less satisfying now that you have you have manipulated it into getting rich? Uh, obtaining things is less satisfying, I suppose, but the game is still so vast that like I don't have an exotic ship because I've only seen one of those this whole time. Now if I you did see one, I could buy it. Now you can just but. be choosy. Yeah. And okay. at the same time, I still haven't done anything with the Atlas Path or anything like that. Oh, yeah, that's true. So, Neither have I. Can't buy that with Moonies. Do you think they changed the ending? Uh, I hope so. Yeah. Wasn't the ending before just traveling further into the rabbit hole? Um, yeah, the ending before was, Congratulations, you made it to the center of the universe. Now start over. Yeah. So... I need to come visit this. Oh, look at that. That's a cool looking freighter up there. That's, that's, that's Andrew Mama's freighter. 
transporting <laughs> transporting maple syrup all across the galaxy. There you is, boy. You got three frigates. I'm right here by your freighter. Big, big oh. papa. Hello. I'm right behind you. Right behind me. Oh, nope. Yep. Right. You're on my compass now. I'm right. Oh, okay. here I am. <laughs> Can you see me? <laughs> nope. I just I just jumped in front of your face. Stay right there. Don't move. Staying still. Oh God, you hit me. Oh. Hey. Ouch. It's the log. The log. The floating this log. Is very odd looking to me. What my ship? <laughs> yeah, it was just yeah. like. The belly of your ship just kind of yeah. waddled up to my <laughs> front window. It's like floating around in a toilet. Hey, apparently we put a base on this planet. Did we? Or did Conrad? Uh, could have been him. I don't know. Yeah, I guess I've never been here. I have been here. I don't because I've been on this system. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to remember old Lou Rag for a, for a while. But I'm gonna go to the space station and go back to home base. Bye. Check out what I need to be doing here, actually. Yeah, I can return to the Overseer. So Bryce ran a D&D &D game with our with our young siblings um, last night. Bryce, do you do you mind talking about that on the on the on the video? Not at all. Uh, it'd be easier if you like ask me questions. Of course, yeah. Um, so our our siblings, uh, if we can be so bold, are Chinese. Um, our parents. Jeez, you're racist. They are. Yeah, they are. They're they're our adopted siblings. We love them dearly. They have enriched our lives. Um, they are. John's John is how old? Uh. It's kind of whatever you want it to be. Well, they, they, when he was found, he was like two, but they said, hey, he looks more like he's five. Yeah. So he could be nine or he could be 11 at this point. You don't really know. He's definitely nine. Yeah, but he's legally 11. Right. In China, at least, right? No, in America. Okay. Gotcha. His birth certificate says 11. Okay. Yeah, so that's. All right, <laughs> that's more complicated than I wanted it to be. Um, anyway, he's nine. He's a nine-year-old boy with an eleven-year-old piece of paper. Yeah. Um, bio biologically, the, the folks in China they they pick you up off the street whenever somebody drops you off, and they give you a, a good lick, see how old you taste, and then they do something with you. Anyway, and Brinley is. 14, 15, 14 and a half. 15. She's, she's not 15. As of August 4th was her birthday. She is 15, and that's why she has her... I thought... It, yeah, I, I, I knew that. I knew... I struggle with the ages. Yeah, me too. So Bailey is 14. God. Now I just feel old. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to talk about this anymore. <laughs> I'm just kidding, but they're they're young is the point, and not as young as I thought this would come out to be. But yeah, 15, um, and 15 and 14 and nine, but the papers say 11. <laughs> and they played D and D with Bryce last night. And was Josh there? 20, by the way. Uh, yeah, Josh and Melissa were. Okay, so they played as well. Okay, cool. Very cool. Did they? Did they? test out their new characters for your campaign or anything? Uh, no. Josh was a fighter again, just to be simple, and Melissa was, I don't know, she healed somebody at one point. I don't remember what all she was. Cool. Very cool. Um, anyway. So it went well. Yeah. John took to it very well. Yeah. This is our youngest brother, John, the one we were talking about. Being. He understood it, like, flawlessly, just about. Which, to Brilliant know him... Were... 
I, I'm not saying that surprises me like he couldn't understand it, but he seems like he would be just very excited and he wouldn't ex take to it as quickly as you would. I feel like he would be cracking cracking jokes and... and not. Yeah, that's how it was originally, but after he got into it, he was in, he was in for it. Cool. Very cool. John played a ranger, that makes me happy. Yeah, I thought it might. I do love rangers. Viking technology kept me safe. I have the selenium required. I cannot imagine they have spent much time conversing with the scientist or the armorer. Ah, to farm. We shall exploit the earth, free at last from the sentinels, and practice the glory of trade. New building part. Hey, I can actually build this. What do you know? Hey. All I require a few circuit boards to finish the plans for a trade terminal of our own. <sighs> circuit boards. I can probably buy those, right? Or I now have to make them. Nope. You gotta make them. Okay. Means you gotta do missions for the scientist. I think I have the circuit board blueprint, don't I? You have a microprocessor blueprint more no. than I <laughs> Yep. All right. Anyway, I'm glad you had fun playing playing with them. We're if I had if I had the time, if we had the time, if we could set it up. I would enjoy seeing that continue on the YouTube. Yeah. Hmm. Here's a question: Can you put a round a round building right on the edge of another? No, you cannot. You cannot do that. Cannot do that. I'm gonna have to build another room for my farming station. Bryce, so when you say you dug out places for your base, like underneath, underneath your base and stuff, did did it all come back whenever you did, when you left? Yeah. I'm gonna test it again and see if that was intentional or just a glitch. Right. Where did, where did you go to? It was on. It was just on like an abandoned planet thing. But whenever you left, where did you go? Uh. I'm like, not... did you leave the system? You left the planet and came back. I mean, we came all the way here and spent several days building bases and like logging on and off. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I had been off the world for quite a while. Gotcha. Mining out underneath this base, baby. I'm gonna try to make a little little basement action. I have Speaking of D&D, &D, you should watch Dungeon Boys as a plug, just to let you know. A little tidbit. So Bryce, now that you have all this money, what do you intend to do? Uh, nothing really. Oh, okay. Just sit around. I don't, I don't really know what I would do with it. I just want to sit around and enjoy my wheel. I gotta mine some pure ferrite so I can build a big round boy. I got lots and lots of uh, magnetized ferrite and ferrite dust. For some reason, I have a ton of magnetized ferrite. That can be converted to pure ferrite. Hmm. Uh, it probably came from destroying ships. Ah, it probably is it. I'm already out here doing it now. I think if our audience likes anything, it's seeing me shoot at a rock. I was thinking that same thing. That's why I didn't offer alternatives. Yeah. Also, there's a glitch. 
I've created a perpetual flame, much like the one that burns outside of JFK's tomb. There's just a, a spark, like the spark effect that happens whenever you shoot a rock. But, perpetually. <coughs> Excuse me. On top of a bush. What's it cost to create a storage unit, Bryce? You know? Uh, it's fairly cheap. Little <laughs> storage Check. unit. There you go. You so exact. Shooting the wrong thing, but I might as well take it now. 20 sodium and 50 magnetized pyrite. Not bad. Not bad at all. What pure ferrite am I going to have now? 202. Oh. Let's get some more. Let's, let's get plenty. Because I want to build more than one round boy. <coughs> this round boy wants to build more than one round boy. Mm. So what else you been up to, Bress? Not terribly much at this time. As I said, I've had a pretty lazy week this week. And as I've said, I think you earned it. You Thank work you. hard, Bryce. Take you a little rest. Uh oh, the sentinel thinks that I don't am I I'm doing bad stuff. Mine from a distance. Don't let it see me. It can't see the giant green laser, I assume. No so, way. Watch out. He keeps trying to move into my laser beam. But I will not have it. Alright, let's see none what we can that. do right now. Said none of that. I will have none of you, sir. Uh oh. Let me get rid of this. Floating ground. Do do do. Do do do. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. Do do do. Do do do. Shake your booty. Shake your booty. Gotta put my ladder in there. Then I'm gonna build. Alright, so I've got a little basement action here. Now I gotta build my my way out. to fill in the bottom of this too but filling in the bottom of things is for chumps yeah chumps ain't no regular people do that only chump people chump people alright let's see I don't understand why they allow terrain to like clip into your base. I would prefer if it did not, but alas, I believe it will. Okay.
there was a way for me to... There we go, change material. Change shape. Flat earth down. Oh, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. We are whoa. not getting onto that. What? <laughs> oh, you got a <laughs> ship? Huh? What are you talking about? You said putting some flat earth down. Oh, sorry. Yeah. We're definitely not getting onto that. <laughs> Good call, Bryce. Good call. Flat earth is not for us. So they may have patched the glitch because I can no longer do that thing. Oh no! <laughs> How dare they have patched a glitch to allow agricultural terminal? Doesn't really matter because you can still have the same effect by just farming a booty load of uh, crops to make glass, nice. living glass. Bryce, my my base is starting to look pretty cool. So we've got to aid the scientists to help to do to do to do to do 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 stuff. I'm gonna come view at you. Come view it before we end this bid you. It's been going for about 21 minutes. No reason to stop till you come over now. Oh lord, we've been going too long. Oh lord, Cleveland. Uh, we'll be refill the oxygen tank. Oh, I really gotta stop taking baths when there's Peter shenanigans <laughs> going on. Right, your your Cleveland is is rather good. Oh God, Peter, that's disgusting. <laughs> I really want, hey y'all. <laughs> I really want to build some glass. Come, enjoy my tour. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, your front door works. Not, not for me. <laughs> You're standing right beside Sales getting no nearer. He's That's ugly cool. as sin. I uh, can't see him, but I also can't walk through him. Yeah, he's ugly. If you'll come up here, you will see my space, my scientist area. Nice to meet you, sir. Don't pretend. I know you can't see him. <laughs> if you'll come down, you go in here. This will be my weapons area. Oh, Lord, this one goes underground. Mm-hmm. Then you drop it low, girl. And that's where we farm. Down here in the low zone. Oh, oh, no. Oh. Yeah, sticking to the left. There we go. Hey. Got it, friend. I wonder... I don't have a, a farmer yet. I wonder if with the ladders, if you put the ladder on oh, the... Oh, um, hey, now. What? How we go on the ground and then this is above ground. Oh, you just dug a hole. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> um, I wonder if you put the ladder like on opposite sides, if that would work. But we shall see. Thank you so much for watching this video, folks. Bryce, you got anything else for the, for the folks back home? Um, not that I can think of. Alright, then we will see you in the next video. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Go check out Dungeon Boys. Go check out Game Talks. Go Game Talks. Go check out all the other stuff we do on the channel. And we'll see you next time. We love you very much. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Uh.